Not everybody loves them, but I think biological edge tests are so cool. I really do because the the ability that's behind them now is really maturing. So there's there's two ones that I really like. There's the epigenetic testing framework, and then there's that glycanage testing framework. And both of us are both of those are in a stage of moving beyond just giving us a biological age value. And so for anyone who's listening and doesn't know what that is, effectively we're able to look inside at signals in the body and express an age of what you look like biologically compared to a given cohort of people similar to you or to your disease risk or risk of developing the diseases of aging. So when we look at some of these tests, I'm getting really excited because behind them is de unpacking the entire epigenome, which is the layer on top of your genetics that determines how your genes are expressed, which those lifestyle factors I mentioned before influence. And this biological age analysis that we've begun to be able to, to compute is now getting the layer added onto it of why are you that age? Why are you older or younger? And here are the knobs you can start to turn to change that result.